Hello everyone, in this video I'd like to introduce you to the Plumduino expansion board. We've provided two sliders, a microphone, a sound element, a motion detector, an infrared remote control receiver and transmitter, as well as prototyping areas to build your own circuits, and access to all the signal lines near the front of the board for easy measuring or connecting more external parts. Based on the position of the sliders, you can program various responses. You can create a musical instrument by coding the sliders to control the sound element. In this example, the top slider controls the pitch and the bottom controls the timing. The motion sensor can pick up movement of people nearby. In one example, we teach you how to create a motion activated burglar alarm. You could also use the motion sensor to turn on lighting at night when you enter a room or walk down a dark hallway. The motion sensor is pretty much the same thing used in motion activated lights or those automatically opening doors at the store. The microphone can be used for basic sound activated activities. Here we've got the lights responding to music. You could customize this basic example to create lighting that turns on if you clap your hands. Each expansion board comes with an infrared remote control and a receiver for the remote control. You can read the buttons pressed on the remote in your code and carry out different actions, like changing the lighting color or deactivating that alarm you made. The infrared transmitter allows you to transmit codes as if the board was a remote control. If you have a Ringo or an IR compatible Wink robot, you can use the IR transmitter to remote control them. The top slider controls the front and back speed, while the bottom slider controls the turning rate. This is basically how the control system works for any remote control toy you've ever had. The expansion board is great for classrooms and workshops because the students don't have to spend any time connecting external components on a breadboard. The main idea with the expansion board together with the Plumduino main board is to teach you how to use sensors and to control outputs based on those sensors. Once you understand how this basic process works, it's easy to use any of the many maker-friendly brain and controller boards available to begin creating your own maker projects that include electronics and computer processors that do smart things.